I was born in suburban Philadelphia. I came from a very middle-class background. I was never a good athlete. I was never a good student. The only thing I was good at was working. At 12 years old, I started a ski tuning shop in my parents' basement. First year, I did $2,500. Next year, there was a, something called a ski swap where a bunch of other local ski shops took all of their last year's inventory and put it on consignment. And I said, hey, why don't you lend me some of the skis and I'll pay you for them as I go. The next year at 13 years old, I did $25,000 in business. After that, I opened my first ski shop. The first year was amazing. I did $125,000. By the time I was 15, I started getting cocky. I actually went out and bought a Porsche before I was old enough to drive it. And at 16 years old, I had a major problem. It didn't snow. So the first time I almost went bankrupt, I was only 16 years old. I have $80,000 of inventory left. So I literally went through the yellow pages, find the different ski shops that I could sell this inventory to. Now, the great thing about that story is that taught me about the closeout business. And now, by the time I'm 21 years old, I've got a $100 million plus closeout business buying and selling excess sneakers and skis. What I learned there is every failure turns into your next opportunity. Now 1998 comes, and I asked everyone, what are you doing about this internet thing? And everyone said the same thing. We don't really have an answer. And that's what led me to start GSI Commerce and reinvent my company. GSI Commerce became the leading provider of e-commerce for the biggest retailers in the world. eBay acquired GSI Commerce in 2011 for $2.4 billion. Fanatics was started within GSI Commerce, but by the time eBay bought it, they didn't want Fanatics, and they asked me to buy it, I did exactly that. Fanatics today is the largest retail in the world of licensed sports merchandise. That means you want to buy any player merchandise, team merchandise, we've got it all. Today, Fanatics has 18,000 employees. We're a company that was last valued at $31 billion. We have over $8 billion of revenue this year. I use that craziness to like be more focused. Was I ever afraid of failure? Hell no. So many people in this world, they're scared to fail, and that's why they never get ahead. I mean, if you sit there trying to figure out, is this going to work? Am I going to fail? Then guess what? You've kind of failed before you've even started. I want to take my shot all the time. I'm the person who wants the ball. I want to go for it. That's who I am. I'm a true entrepreneur. I was born an entrepreneur. It's the only thing I've ever been good at. For me, to be part of Shark Tank, it's an honor. It's a privilege. I can't wait to see all these bright faces who want to come in and show us their ideas, and I can't wait to invest in some of them.